you think? Good. Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Tuesday morning, July 10, 2018, and I'm headed into work for the day. And uh, I've been having this pain, like on the like the side of my leg, like right next to my knee, and it's tender to the touch. So I'm not sure what that's about. I don't know if that was from when I um, was camping. If I like laid on that, like on the ground or something, on the hard ground. But uh, it fucking hurts, man. So I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, so today is Tuesday. Um, don't really have much planned. So my parents came back yesterday. They're going to be leaving again tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow I'm going over by Luke's. We're going to meet up with his sister and mom and him. And we're going to talk about various stuff for his sister's wedding. Uh, her sister's wedding is, I want to say, 11-10. So November 10th. And uh, she wants me to shoot it for her because uh, Luke's going to be in the wedding or his family is going to be helping out and all that type of stuff. So, which is cool. Very cool. I am um, tired, but I do uh, feel way better rested than yesterday, that's for sure. So I got uh, probably a cumulative amount of about eight hours of sleep. I think it went to bed around 10, got up around 6. Uh, Sophie was up twice in the night. She's got a limp going on, so I don't know if my leg's hurting as sympathy pains for Sophie or what. Um, very freaking weird. But uh, uh, back is still kind of out of whack a little bit. Uh, that was bothering me last night as I was sleeping. That kind of kept, kept me waking up a little bit here and there. But uh, overall, I think I'm doing all right. Um, I'm trying to think what else is going on here this week. So that's Wednesday. So Wednesday, uh, Luke and I, we really got to get the... Um, we really got to get the... Uh, those weddings finished up so his him and his wife are due pretty damn soon so uh, her official due date is 8 8 august 8th but i think she's almost ready to pop at any time and um yeah like i said pretty soon here we're not going to be able to be doing all this work and stuff so we do we do have another wedding in a couple months um i want to say it's after the baby should be due and all that but we just need to kind of get caught up or get finished to kind of clear the deck because once that baby comes, it's going to be fucking crazy. Um, so we're going to kind of try to work on and focus on that uh, this week. And then, I don't know, I'm trying to determine what I want to do this weekend. If I wanted to go over to the lake cabin, if I wanted to kind of hang out with some friends this weekend, if I wanted to... Um, I don't know. I, I don't know. There's a there's like a, a monthly car show thing on Saturday that you know I used to go to all the time with my Cutlass and stuff. So I'm just not quite sure. I was thinking about it. It'd be nice to get my Cutlass out of storage and actually drive it here and there, or at least uh, get it up and running. But uh, I don't know if I'm gonna have time or money for that. Uh, I was thinking about it. I still owe. Um, Grant's mom's mom money through the divorce. It was part of the paperwork and all that type of stuff. And it was uh, something that uh, I'm not happy about. It's, it's a decent amount of money. And yeah. I've talked about it before in the past and all that. Maybe I'll bring it up again, but just complete bullshit. So I got to figure out how to pay that off, save up for that. Otherwise, uh, that's due by the end of the, the year. But the quicker, sooner I can do that, then the sooner I can fucking move on, I guess. So I have money and savings, but 
it's kind of like my emergency fund. So I'm trying to determine, you know, what to do or whatever. I also have the acorns. So I've been accumulating savings or money, I guess, in, in my acorns account. And I'm trying to, uh, I was thinking that, you know, by the end of the year I might have enough or pretty much enough to cover that, uh, that outstanding bill or whatever it's called. Long, I don't know. Huh. So not much important stuff to talk about here. I'm not going to see the new girl for like another like couple weeks or something. So she says she's free like Sunday night after her show. But she already is talking about wanting to go to the Beatles cover band thing. And I just, I, 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 I don't know. I, yeah, I don't want to be driving all over the place for this cover band thing so she can make some money working or whatever. Um, I'm not against it. I really am not. I'm trying to be open to all this. But, like, a date that she's working? Um, yeah, I don't know. So, uh, that's it. I'm going to uh, cut this off here. I don't really have much else going on. I need to dust my car, my dash and all that. I got a little like uh, feather duster type of thing that I could grab from the house. Uh, today, I got I gotta take this, take it easy on this leg, but I got a ton of shit to do. So I'm trying to figure out how to balance all that. So there is a, a few things that I'm gonna work on and get done today that should finish up. Um, couple projects and then uh, I still have a, a bunch of other stuff that's outstanding or still going on so keep you guys posted and uh, oh another side note too with the uh, time-lapse feature on the camera the one that's built into this camera I am not really a fan of it so I guess it takes like one photo every like five seconds and then it stitches them all together into a video and you know I guess normally it would be fine or whatever it's just that it, it's too slow of an increment so I don't know I'll have to double check and see if you can change it you know if it was one photo or whatever or one frame every second it'd be more fluid but because it's it takes so long it's, uh, it's a very jerky time-lapse video I guess you could say so probably what I'll end up doing is just uh, filming whatever I'm doing in real time and then just speed it up and post it'll be quicker so that's just an idea and smoother and, and cooler looking so yeah that's it guys stay tuned for more this camera just in case you're wondering it's the Olympus TG tracker and it's underwater it's uh, waterproof it has an uh, onboard LED light it does uh, a tracking feature so it has GPS built in Wi-Fi and it shoots 4k so